It was important for Jody Wilson-Raybould to speak openly at the Justice Committee today, and I'm glad she had the chance to do so. I strongly maintain, as I have from the beginning, that I and my staff always acted appropriately and professionally. I therefore completely disagree with the former Attorney General's characterization of events. Our government will always focus on jobs and our economy. We of course had discussions about the potential loss of 9,000 jobs in communities across the country, including the possible impact on pensions. My job as Prime Minister has always been to stand up for Canadians and Canadian workers. I want to be absolutely clear here. The decision around SNC-Lavalin was Ms. Wilson-Raybould's and hers alone. I want to confirm this again for Canadians, as Ms. Wilson-Raybould herself confirmed today. This decision is the Attorney General's alone. As we govern and make decisions for the good of all Canadians, we will always act within the bounds of what is appropriate. There is an officer in Parliament whose entire function is to look into questions of this nature. So I welcome the investigation by the Ethics Commissioner to clear the air on this matter, and it's important that we trust him to do his job. While this process continues, my steadfast focus will remain on Canadians and on governing in the best interests of people across this country. Um, the Conservatives are calling for your resignation, and we're wondering if you think you should resign and if you think anyone in the PMO or Cabinet should resign. Canadians uh, will have a very clear choice in a few months' time about who they want to be Prime Minister of this country and what party they want to, to uh, uh, form government uh, in the general election coming up in a few months. There will be a clear choice to be made between uh, the Liberal Party, this government that has always invested in Canadians, that has created uh, record economic growth, record low unemployment, has consistently stood up for Canadian jobs, cons consistently defended Canadian jobs while defending our institutions and the independence of our judiciary. And on the other hand, uh, there is a choice of the party that is still very much the party of Stephen Harper, that continues to attack, to divide, to play politics with big issues, and to consider that the best way to create economic growth is still to give advantages to the wealthiest. We disagree. That is why we have been working so hard over the past three years to invest in Canadians, to support Canadians, and we've succeeded in creating the economic growth that we've seen, and we will continue to do. And can Jody Wilson-Raybould stay in the Liberal caucus, and will you allow her to run in the next federal election as a Liberal? Uh, as you might imagine, I haven't yet had the opportunity to uh, review her entire testimony. I will do that before making any further decisions.